Hi, this is Ian, your SDMLS specialist. Let's talk about how to maintain your listing in Paragon. For mastery of this and all topics, remember to play, pause, and practice. There are two ways to find your listing. The first option is going to the listing icon here in Paragon and clicking on it. When you see your options appear, we're going to move the mouse straight down and then over to the word listings under maintain. When you click on here, we're going to see your active listings immediately appear onto this page. We're going to start to see options for us to be able to maintain your listing. The second way to get to this page would be by doing a simple search for your listing. We can use the power search to enter in your MLS number. Once your MLS number is typed in, you're going to see the address right here on the page. Let's click on it to open up that listing. You may notice that we are viewing the agent preferred one as the default report, but what we want to focus on is right here along the top, and it's the button here that says Actions. When you are on your own listing, you can click on Actions and then straight down to Maintain Listing. Let's click on Maintain Listing and we're going to get to a familiar page. The one difference is that you will only see the one listing you're looking for as opposed to all of your active listings. However you choose to get to this page, this is great. Let's start from here. Select an action will give you the most commonly used options that you will need for your listing. Maintain listing will allow you to open up your listing input to change any or all fields of the listing. However, if you just need to make a quick price change, let's click on here. You'll notice that a box opens up that allows you to update your price and simply click Save. By doing this, there's no need to go into your entire listing. In addition to price change, you can also update your expiration date. You can edit the public remarks. Add Edit Virtual Tour. Again, like the price change, simply takes you to the field where your virtual tour link can be added. Another helpful option is the Add Edit Open House and the Add Edit Tour. The open houses, of course, are the public open houses, while the tour is otherwise known as the broker caravan. This is a lovely shortcut here to help you add or subtract pictures onto your listing. When you click on Picture Administration, you have a shortcut into the picture section of your listing. The other two wonderful options are here, of course, when your home is ready, is uh, being sold and you are ready to mark it as closed, you can simply click right here on Sold Closed. It's going to add the status in for you and then immediately take you down into the sold section where you will fill out the remaining fields and then click Save. One of the last things I'd like to show you today on this page is your view activity report. The view activity report is very helpful and gives you great data about your listing. When you click on this item, you're going to see a series of numbers. These numbers are related to this MLS number. For instance, there have been 661 matched save searches for this listing. So there are 661 saved searches out there that are seeing this listing in it. It has been viewed 728 times, which means that someone has actually not only gotten to see the results, but they've clicked on the link to read more. You can also see how many agents have looked at the listing, as well as how many clients have looked at the listing. There are a great 
there's a great resource up here in the top right corner, which actually goes over what all of these numbers mean and where they were calculated, how they were calculated, excuse me. The only other item I'll bring your attention to is the fact that you can now share your listing on Facebook. You can create your own link to share it anywhere you'd like. There are always lovely options here for SentryLock. If you use SentryLock, uh, you can assign and also track your access. And the last but not least, your showing time setup. This will allow you to set up automated notifications uh, for your listing if someone wants to show the property. Uh, there is a great training video set up for showing time. Please feel free to visit sdmls.com and go toward the top left hand corner uh, to Paragon and then training videos for more information on that. But this has been how to maintain your listing. Again, please go to sdmls.com, click on Paragon in the top left corner, and go to training videos for information on other topics. This has been Ian, your SDMLS specialist, reminding you to play, pause, and practice.